Toosie. <laughs> it's a fake ass smile, but it's okay. Smile anyway, right? Y'all, it has not even been 30 days since I had to get on here and share sad news about Real Housewives of Atlanta star Drew Sedora divorcing her husband Ralph Sedora ahead of the Real Housewives of Atlanta season 15 premiere. And I'll be damned if Eva Marcel wasn't in the car right behind them on her way to the Fulton County Courthouse to file her paperwork too. Oh no, 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 no! It's Justin Diego and I guess I'm back with another binge worthy video. And today, I hate to say it, but Eva Marcel just filed for divorce from Michael Sterling after just five years of marriage. And y'all, things are not looking good. Now you can feed in the peace. Now that you open the cage, nobody's safe. 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 Y'all, what is going on with our Atlanta housewives in these breakups? Lord have mercy. With this news of Eva Marcel, I feel like ain't no telling who's next. Now, y'all know it's never good news when any couple announces a divorce, but it's always considerably worse when the details of their situation starts coming out. Yes, that's exactly the news we opened Instagram and found out about when The Shade Room was one of the first to announce that the Real Housewives of Atlanta's own Eva Marcel and Michael Sterling are officially ending their marriage after Eva Marcel filed, citing the marriage as being irretrievably broken and declared that there was no possibility of reconciliation. Ooh, 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 ooh. Eva Marcel finally released a statement to People Magazine after details from the alleged court documents have been making their way across the internet. In her statement, she said, This has been one of the hardest decisions I have ever had to make, but sometimes life takes your journey in a direction you are not expecting. Our children remain our biggest priority, and the eight and a half years we have spent together will always be cherished. We ask that you respect our privacy at this time. It's crazy because they always seem so happy. And Eva Marcel just posted on Valentine's Day about Michael being her forever man, and that was just a couple of weeks ago. Radar Online is also claiming that Eva Marcel is allegedly demanding primary custody of their children and child support from Michael. Mm, 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 mm. The Bravo star is also asking her husband to be ordered to contribute to the care and maintenance of the children, including but not limited to their medical bills. Y'all, this is a mess. And while it's way too early to have all the details on this story, it's hard not to go ahead and start speculating about how bad things must be for things to have escalated so quickly and for her to deem their situation as being literally unreconcilable. And the crazy part is, I just saw Eva Marcel in the headlines talking about that whole Tamar versus Candy drama from last week. And she mentioned being upset that Tamar's post made people speculate that she was talking about her and her husband. Yeah. My husband is the only politician in the history of Housewives. Right, so right. one would only assume that they're talking about me. The way she went about it, she knew the way she posted was gonna make people speculate. No, because ain't that weird and like kind of awkward to be defending your husband all while knowing that you literally either filed or plan on filing for a divorce in just a couple of days? Like, I just would have, you know, told TMZ like, mm-hmm, yep, mm-hmm, yep, no, no, no comment or something because I certainly wouldn't be referring to a man as my husband when I know y'all about to get the tea. And y'all already know Housewives fans were also feeling so caught off guard about this news of Eva's divorce responding. Oh no, they seem so happy and supportive of each other. But I guess you never know, exclamation point. And they were just in love on Valentine's Day. That's why I don't be believing nothing I see on social media. With another Housewives fan chiming in saying, do not expect this one at all, dot, dot, dot. With the sad emoji, before one fan said she kind of saw this coming, replying under a post saying, 
I knew something was up, exclamation point. She was posting way too much and didn't see him in one pic, exclamation point. Sad. And y'all, I was in shock myself commenting. OMG, say psych right now, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, with the shit face emojis. And I don't know if Nini's story was related at all to the situation, but she talking about, we all outside, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. Yes, hunty. Some are about to be lit with the fire emoji. And we're just gonna keep an eye on Nini because I saw this post that she made the other night as well I'm talking about why do I keep meeting narcissists am I doing something to attract them question mark this is a real question help so there may be something brewing between Nini and her little boo thing but this ain't really about Nini so I'll get back to that on another day because one housewife story reminded me that Eva and her husband definitely have to figure some stuff out with their kids fast commenting OMG, no, exclamation point, exclamation point. Divorce is such a mess. That little girl was even adopted by him. I feel for this family, more especially the kids. I hope they treat this divorce with the delicacy it requires and they are mature about how they go about co-parenting. Before another fan was definitely sharing those same concerns saying, nah, this hurt me with the crime face emojis. I like seeing them together and those beautiful kids. Y'all know some folks just want to see how the drama plays out in a shady divorce. Talking about Chow. After she done fought to change that little girl last name from her real father's name, question mark, question mark, question mark. Tragic. And speaking of shady divorces, if you missed any details about Drusadora and Ralph racing to beat each other to fall first for their divorce, be sure to check out my previous video for all the tea. Cause period, it was too good. Yes. Comment right now and tell me what you guys think about all this. Were you surprised to see Eva Marcel and her husband getting a divorce? Or were you one of those people who feel like you saw it coming? I'll definitely be following this story as it continues to develop. Thank you so much for watching this video all the way to the end. I will see y'all divorcees <laughs> on the next one. This might be soon because it seems like everybody is getting a divorce. <laughs> Dude, I can't even get married. Fumble a bag.